What news? I have failed. My pleas for appeals fell on deaf ears. Uh, what do I care about that? I speak of your arm. Will it heal? Uh, oh, uh, right. Of course. He tells me I will lose all use of it within the year. But surely he can craft for you a new one, right? He may once have been able to, yes, but that was 14 years ago. Uh. Highness! Maester Felgreed! I throw myself upon your mercy. I beg you, create a new prosthesis. You know my answer. I beseech you! Do me this one kindness, and I swear by all my forefathers that you shall never again have to see another of my line. Is that truly why you ventured into this backwater? To give your retainer a health check? I confess that was not my aim at first, but now... Now I am here for no other purpose than to see my dearest friend well at last. I entreat you, Maester. Help him. <sighs> the materials I'd need were lost to your kingdom 14 years ago. Nothing short of time travel can see that prosthetic of his made new. This cannot be. This is the best I can offer him now. I was warned that the arm might last into adulthood, so I prepared this just in case. With some adjustments, it should provide you with more than enough mobility to lead an ordinary life. But not one of night. Still, that's a fancy piece of gadgetry. How's it powered? For no semiomancer, you're quite perceptive. Busted. It's plain to see there's no semiomantic connection between you and your orb, and yet still, it heeds your command. I confess, I've never seen anything like it. How does it work? That's the million fall question, isn't it? Sure would be great if you could help us answer it, though. You think I'll be cozened by such tricks? Come on, man. If this kingdom goes down, it's taking you with it. If Asarius' fate rests entirely on my shoulders, then they deserve what's coming. Uh, Maester! End of discussion. However, I have a responsibility to see to your arm, one I won't neglect. Anything beyond that is none of my concern. As you wish. No, Highness. I have witnessed firsthand how much this village has come to rely upon you. I cannot in good conscience deprive these people of your services. I ask only that you provide Albert with the care he so rightly deserves. Wow. <laughs> Distress signal received. Distress signal received. Huh? Confirmed. Edis affiliated. Escape craft. Entering current orbit. Analyzing call signal. Executive officer, Elena, on board. Already? But how? Something's wrong. Who speaks? And what's that map? Not now. <laughs> Elena? Elena, come in. Ray, my escape craft has just entered Aster 4's gravitational field. But the attitude control systems can't be operated manually. Deceleration is impossible. Here are my projected landing coordinates. Got it. See you soon. And stay safe, okay? I will certainly try. Over. Um, what the heck was that? <gasps> Sorry, guys, but something came up. Gonna need to leave you for a bit. Over my dead body. This is serious. I'm aware. So why then think to go off alone? Ugh. Maester Felgreed, I'm afraid we must leave you for now. Albert and I have sworn to assist Ray in locating his companions. Where he goes, so must we. However, upon our return, I would ask that you tend to Albert's arm. Ray, let's hurry. Thanks. She's coming in too hot. I'm sorry. 
She has landed in treacherous terrain. She is beyond our help, if she survived at all. Yeah, damn it! Come. Maester? You mean to get to that meteorite? Then follow me. Thanks, man. I owe you. You are good to help us, Maester. Thank you. I do this for my village, not for you. Hmm. I saw him, you hold you saw him, he saw me, saw me, my cell phone. Uh huh. Keep telling yourself that. <laughs> but who he is. And who. Oh my god. What do you mean reset? Uh, oh. No, but how do I. No, no, wait, wait. I think it was here. No, it wasn't. No, no, it wasn't here. Is his reserved reserved party? Okay. No, no, wait, wait. Change party. Oh. Dude, you're going to join me? Are you going to join me? There's one way to. Oh, you're going to join me? Yeah, he's going to join me. You're going to join me. I know you're going to join me. I can see that on your face. Kill three. Oh, this dude must be handful. God, yeah. And heal. Yeah. Are you? A wait, what? What are you? No, you are. Wait, wait, wait. What are you? You are hit. Oh wow. Okay, skill three. So I kinda need this, and I need this too. Well, he's a full magician here. He's full, full magician. Like, yeah, he's full, full freaking magician. this is magic you know and skill no uh, passive skill do you have one oh firebolt final chain Hmm, okay. If he's full magician, let me handle this. 
Uh-uh. Yep. Wait. Oh my god. The meteorite likely fell near the Galka Shrine. It's not very far from the village. Come, this way. Dude, you're amazing. Be like he hasn't done anything. <laughs> it's amazing. Look at it. Oh my god. Okay. I want a grandpa. You're my grandpa. I have adopted you. You adopt me. Whatever. Where is the place where I can, you know, <laughs> buy stuff, maybe? Items? Blueberry? Okay, is this an inn? What the hell is this? What? Why I can open a door of a house? Where I c Are you guys fighting? Oh, oh I, I, I see it. It should be this. We're all set. Let's hurry over to Elena. We can leave through the western gate. Don't mind us. see no 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 sorry sorry dude am I rich or something Make it a point to return. We're coming. Hey, wait, where, where are my things? Why, why you don't have anything? I have no idea what is that Use this for the time being. Yes, okay, let's go. No. Ooh, nice. My grandpa is the picture, my grandpa is everything. Sorry. <laughs> oh, oh, eh. Uh, Help. Oh no. Oh, oh, damn. Okay, I think I'm kind of like stuck. Oh, no. <laughs> I survived. Okay, we're coming. Is it? Ah, this Follow way. the side road until you reach the shrine. Be quick about it. Let's try this. Enemies up I don't like shrines. Oh, oh, wait, I, I forgot something. Oh my god, snow. Okay. Mm. 
Blueberry. 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 No, calm down. Chain combo. Blueberry. 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 Chain. No, no, no. Oh, wait, yes. Wait, wait, wait. I need to. Wait, 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 wait. Can't wait to see how much better I do. Can't wait to see how much better I do. Okay, never mind. Chain combo. Blueberry. Blueberry. Uh, strength. I shan't hold the others back. Okay, there we go. Let's go. <laughs> I was like, I wish we are going to some way to impress that got snow and they give me this. Let's go. The structure in the center is the Galka Shrine. Let's see what awaits us inside. You guys do you. How exquisite. Oh, damn. I don't even want to take the purple crystals because how fine they look. Is that a place? Elena! Son of a. Elena! Need some assistance? Albert, take the other side. We three ought to suffice. Ah. Ready. Oh. Is she a machine? <sighs> Status. Right leg and left arm have sustained heavy damage. Pedal circuitry offline in both right hand and left leg. Single drive is non functional at the moment. Current power is being supplied from reserve energy source. In maintenance mode, I have at most 56 hours remaining. Advanced processing functions are also limited, preventing movement. Right. How can I help? Due to depleted energy levels, I will be unable to perform repairs myself. Furthermore, I can no longer salvage the parts I need from this damaged craft. Crap. So what are we supposed to do? Take me offline and destroy me. It is imperative that we prevent our technology from falling into the hands of anyone here. Are you crazy? What kind of captain would I be if I told my crew to start offing themselves? There's another way out of this. I know it! Of course. The equipment this life form requires to reconstruct itself can most likely be recovered from your downed escape pod. Well, you certainly pick very convenient times to start talking. <laughs> I speak only when necessary, such as my programming. Thank you for deciding to pipe up now, because you're absolutely right. My escape pods barely sustained any damage. Think that'd work for you, Elena? I don't see why not. So long as you can collect enough of what I need. I should be able to restore my motor control systems to previous output levels. Here. This should be everything. Thanks. You go into maintenance mode. Save your energy best you can. Just keep a comm channel open for me, got it? Understood. Ray, I take this to mean we are returning to the site of your ship? You mind? It's 
kinda out of the way. It may be, but we do not mind. We agreed to assist you in the search for your crew, and we intend to honor that agreement. Uh, wait. Don't know about you guys, but personally, I am super confused. <gasps> I won't ask you to explain now, but you will tell us what's going on eventually, right? Oh, yeah, definitely. You said there was another meteorite not unlike this one, did you not? Huh? Yeah, why? I should like to see it, therefore I shall be joining you. Oh, yeah. so now you're interested in what we're up to. How quickly we change our minds. What did you say? <laughs> you're free to come. Glad you want to, honestly. Because your help's gonna be invaluable. You've got tech like nothing I've seen here. And I'll sleep easier knowing Elena's got you in her corner. Glad I could be your soporific. And you're sure it's okay to leave her here alone? She will be fine. The villagers will know better than to enter, and I doubt any of the local fiends will make it this far. Then let's get cracking. We're on the clock here, people. Move it! Right behind you. Can I, like... Okay. The thing when I use a caster, the enemies kind of like want to kill me because I'm the one controlling them. Like oh, that's so rude. Oh, well, we already killed him. I just talk when it's indeed necessary. Wait, wh what the hell? Girl, <laughs> what? Is everybody here? Because I want to use my grandfather, uncle. Look, he even got a cape, a hat, a cane. He does magic. And he can hit people. Like, what else do I want from the war? Nothing. Thank you very much for being my grandpa. He's more an, of an uncle. Like the cool freaking. Oh, oh. Where, where are we? Where is, where, where is the enemy? I don't see him. I was going to cast a spell, but alright. Do I see things around? No. Wait, 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 I see, I see. There are people. Ray, hold a moment. By the looks of it, someone has stolen the march on us. Friends of yours? Not sure. I don't think so. <coughs> Who's there? Certainly answers my question. Move it or lose it, jerks! We don't have time for this! Go away! Damn it! Very good. Retreat! Something fishy's going on. How were they able to control the pod like that? Come to think of it, how'd they even figure out it was here in the first place? Rather than contemplate unanswerable questions, I would advise that you focus instead on the expedient retrieval of the components the android requires. Hey, Elena, can you hear me? Yes. We found the pod. Just tell us what you need and we'll get to cutting. Understood. First, remove the pilot seat. Behind it, you should find a panel. Open it. We get to dismantle it. <laughs> Excellent. Glad someone's excited. <laughs> I have never seen this level of craftsmanship. What tools could produce anything with such impressive detail? Uncle Midas, 
Work now, ask later. Next, I will need you to obtain the parts necessary to replace my Symbo Drive unit. This will require the removal of the pod's generator. When it's removed, you will be unable to make any more long-range subspace communications. Roger that. Let me call my brother real quick then. See if I can't get him to hurry it up a little. Computer, get me Antonio Lawrence. Unable to establish connection. What? Uh, fine, then try my dad. Get me Raul Lawrence. Unable to establish connection. Long-range subspace communication may be unable to reach the Virgold system at this time. What the hell? Ray, listen. So long as you're stranded here, you can't afford to lose your lines of communication. My recovery will have to wait. Sorry, but my captain's intuition is telling me otherwise. We're getting you patched up, whether you like it or not. But... My brother's already on his way, plus Chloe's still out there. And how am I supposed to save her without you, huh? You gotta trust me on this one, okay? Everything will be fine. Understood. Using the parts you salvaged, you'll need to begin by repairing my circuitry, followed by both my arm and hand. At which point I should be recovered enough to repair the remainder of my body myself. Estimated time until completion, 72 hours. Uh, okay? <laughs> That's about the time I expected it would take. Leticia, I know this kind of derails things. But you cool to wait around? Of course. But Albert and I shall make the most of it. There is little doubt that many in the region witnessed the descent of Elena's craft. We will find out what they make of it. And we may discover the identity of those we caught snooping about your ship. I don't know. It is not without its dangers, I grant you. But if there are more of those men out there, it may affect Elena's chances at recovery. That's true, but it's a lot to ask. Where friends are concerned, it is a trifle. Count me in too! You guys will need a healer on hand in case Albert's arm starts acting up again, right? Your company would be a boon indeed. If my suspicions are correct and those men are with the Empire, then we will need all the help we can get. We will return to the shrine three days hence. Elena should be on her feet by then. Okay. So, quick question. Who is Ray exactly? If only I knew. Wait, so does anyone know who he is? <laughs> we know only what he tells us. That he comes from beyond the stars or some such. Uh, beyond the stars? I admit, we were hard pressed to believe it as well. But after all we have borne witness to... <sighs> so, is that orb a similar deal? Is it from beyond the stars, too? It was cargo on Ray's ship, although he is just as mystified by it as we are. So many questions! <laughs> and no answers. In any event, the fewer people who know about all of this, the better. To that end, let us find out just how far the rumors of Elena's craft have spread. Come from the forest north of here? Then. then you must have seen that comet. So. stumble on anything out of the ordinary? Anything that might start a fire in the groves? Everything was perfectly normal, I assure you. May I ask, did you happen to notice from which direction the comet fell? Looked to me as if it came from the east, toward Delbrick in that area. I see. Thank you very much. Best to expand our search to Delric, then. Let's be off.
Oh, wait. In a oh. town so large as this, perhaps it would be prudent to narrow our search. Let's start with Dr. Eason, then. I'm betting he'll put us on the right track. Good idea. I still have to thank him for his help with Maester Felgreed. Ah, uh, let him know what the we up to. Or that the clinic is up the hill from here, on the opposite side. Thank you know the way? Of course. Let us hope Maester Marcus is in. Pardon us. Lady Leticia, back so soon. Have you met with Midas? Yes, and he was good enough to tend to Albert's arm. Although, he would not even so much as entertain our other request. Branches oft bend to a persistent wind. So, how can I help the four, oh, pardon me, three of you today? Got a question for you. Did you hear anything about a strange shooting star recently? Oh, to be sure. It was quite the sight. Never seen anything like it. It was all anyone could talk about. Little wonder, the way it scored the skies over Rifle. Oh, great. So the whole western portion of the kingdom saw it? Which would mean that the people of Rythal had a clear view. We should check in. Alright then. Um, I'm just, I'm just imagining a group of guards waiting for me. Oh, don't tell me you three are here for a bed at the infirmary too. What are you talking about? Oh, you're not. Sorry. Got a lot of people here looking for treatment, but the sick beds are just about full up. Treatment for what? <sighs> Beats me. Things are weird, I tell ya. First, there's word that the rot's going around again, then that comet. Nothing but ill omens. Easy to see why everyone's on edge. I suppose our best bet is to start with Dr. Vanell. He may know more than most. Flying. Floating. Flying. Floating. No, not in the water. Oh, thank the stars! Whoa, Doc! You wouldn't believe the number of sick I've been treating. Please, I need your help. It is quite all right, Nina. The two of us will be fine. Stay and assist Dr. Vanell. We shall return for you later. Oh, thanks so much, you two. I owe you one. I'd rather not distract the doctor now. He seems a touch frazzled. Then mayhaps the townspeople will have something for us. <laughs> oh my god. Nina will have her hands full with assisting. Hmm. Without proper leads, I am not certain where best to begin. I have heard the ideal location to gather intelligence is at a tavern. Is that so? Does such a place exist within Rifle? Let us question those individuals there. Um, excuse me. <laughs> I'm telling you, I saw it with my own eyes. Yeah, some nasty goblin man came crawling out of that comet. He's what's been spreading this illness, I tell you. A goblin from a comet? <laughs> I find that quite a hard story to swallow. I was out on the wharf when that thing came down. And then, where there was nothing, poof, this weird looking fellow popped up. I ain't never seen anyone like him. Care to describe him? A horn! He had a horn! And, and, and his skin is like twilight all all purpley. And now you try telling me that thing ain't the cause of this plague. A man with a horn came out of the comet. All right, that's quite enough out of you. Sorry, been out of work so long, not much to do save drink. No, it is quite all right. Channel's meant to open back up any day now. Get us back to Salem. Although these crazy rumors about falling stars and plagues could put an end to those hopes. But really, don't take any of these weird blatherings to heart. 
Perhaps we should return to the infirmary. Goblin. <laughs> Are things looking better here? A bit. Not that I was able to do much. Anyway, learn anything useful? Only that there is indeed a great deal of talk. At this juncture, I believe it is safe to say that the whole western half of the kingdom is aware of the comet. And considering the interest around it, more people may yet try to investigate the crash site. We must move Elena from the shrine as soon as possible. I fear we do not have long. That settles it. Back to her pod we go. But back to my bed I go. To get to the Galka Shrine, we had to cross the Larkis region into the Delvir region again. A significant journey indeed. We should make certain we are properly prepared. Pardon us. Somebody gonna kill me. Oh, welcome. What do you have? The harbor lights are quite lovely. I must say, you set a very fine table. I'm hungry. Huh. Early morning brings the Let us be about it. Bye bye. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, sorry, that wasn't the thing that I meant to do. Excuse me, sir. Why there's something very near? If somebody wants to fight me? Begging your pardon, but where are you off to? Delric, and you, sir? Are you a wayfarer? Oh, something like that. Heard about an odd shooting star in these parts and came to see for myself. You lot seem to have a marked interest in it as well, by the sounds of it. What? Couldn't help but notice that orb of yours. Quite a rare specimen. Piqued my curiosity, you see. Enough of this beating around the bush, then. Are you here to retrieve us? Are you here to take us back? Forgive me, but I do not take your meaning. I see. Just my luck. And yours is not any better, it seems. Warning. Warning. Hostile intent detected. Oh, thank you, Duma. Really with horns? That skin, that horn, the rumors were true. Really hate to do this, but one has to do what one has to do. Oh, wait. Ouch. Come on, guys. Um, here, eight wow. didn't know it was capable of that, and we have only just begun. Nope. Is that the best you can do? Cut them to 
Ooh. The hell are you? Oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa. Thank you. Thanks. There we go. Get that die. I was too careless. Here I thought you would just roll over and die. It seems we'll have to pick this up another time. Attempt to flee, and you will find out just how fast and painful my chakram are. Easy there, we'll most likely see each other again soon. But until then, I'll leave the falling star to you. Hold there! Ugh! Blast it! Of all the times! Albert! We must return to the others with all haste. They need to know of this. Huh? Too epic. Oh <laughs> my god. <laughs> Okay guys, we're gonna learn it here. Oh my god. So, thank you so much for watching and see you next one. If you guys want, I don't know. All the lights are passing by And all my thoughts, they multiply I see it flash before my